Hi, I'm Ian Brown, and this is the glamour of backstage seeing the park. The festival's are great because you get the chance to play to people that might not know you, might not have seen you, might don't know your music, might not even hear any, anything that you know, you know. Uh, at your own shows, people already bought the tickets, so the love's already there as soon as you walk in. It's electric, you can't buy that, you know. Well, I'm slowly been recovering. I got a tats on stage like only four weeks ago. Dragged off some crackhead, just pulled me straight off the stage. Didn't even get a chance to grapple with him. As a result, I got 10 stitches in my head. I got a little whip lash of the neck. It's walking around like Gladstone Smalls for a while, but I've got a little... I still can't move my, my head left to right. I'm 90%, you know. So, what I've been doing is just recovering and getting my strength back, you know, for the month. Like, I'm a kid who exercises and stretches. I've not even been able to do that. You know, I've gone for walks and all, but I like my fitness levels. I've lost a little fitness levels because I've been injured that way, so... I'm just pacing it now, nice and easy, and I'm lucky enough that I'm out in the sunshine here in Scotland to help the music. The music, actually, last night I played in Preston. The music is a good, is a healer, and the music is healing me, you know. I'm looking to the songs because I'm in a little pain in the daytime, you know. So when I come off the stage last night, I felt a little easier. I felt better than I felt in a month, and that was bathing in the music that I'd done that, you know. I'm just writing songs at the moment for my next record, yeah. I'm always writing songs, but you know, when I get down to thinking, right, I'm going to make a record now, I start looking at all the songs, you know, what's it going to be right, what's going to be right for this. I'm working on something now. I never realised that I'd still be making music all these years later. I think I'm in love with the process, you know. I'm in love with the process of making something out of nothing, and then that, that something then, you never, you don't know where it's going to take you. I get kids of 14 who've just bought me a record last week, you know, it amazes me. I feel so great, I, I come to a show and I see kids are like 14 at the front and at the back's like guys are 50. It's amazing. <laughs>